love when I feel that I have family around me. I'm talking about in the spiritual, you know. Um, I was led to look up under this bed for, for a reason, you know. I've been coming and spending annual um, summers, different type of weeks with my mother um, for a while now, you know, since I got older. Um, and like I said, I never decided to look up under the bed. And this is what I found. Y'all, the paper that was in there is a receipt. It just says October 11th. And you know that's the time when the veil is open. But it don't have a date or anything on it like a year. But it just has October 11th. Wow, I kind of wish it had a name or something on there. Y'all know I, how I am about them names. When I help you guys um, research your ancestors and stuff, I'm always um, enthused when I find different names from your family line so you can, you know, give them a little love with intention and light them a candle and things like that. You never know how far that go in the spiritual realm, and I'm all for that. Um... But I'm sure whoever the ancestor was that owned this silverware, because it's pretty old, you know. Um, but it definitely comes from my family line. And it might have been like what, like a chest that was passed down from member to member in the family line. So that's pretty cool. But Yeah, I love older stuff. I just, like I say, I love the nostalgia of it. Any of y'all like that squeaky sound? That's, that's how you know when something is clean. <laughs> that squeaky sound. Comment down below if you like, you really like that. You you don't stop washing your dishes until you hear, until you, um, hear that squeaky sound. Like, uh-uh, you need to hear that sound in order to be done with washing it. This was another older one she gave me, my first strainer, my mother. My father is no longer in this realm, but my mother is still here. I would be what you call a middle child, but I'm sort of kind of a middle child. Um, you, I know you're like, what does that mean, sort of, kind of? I'm a middle child because my mother, um, I have a sister. She's older. But when my father and my mother got together, she had already had my sister. But I'm my father's first child with my mother. Before he passed, they had been married over 40 years. Yeah. Well, at least, let me see, over 35. I want to say that stuff. Over 35 years. Y'all be sure to check out my other page at Lasonia Cultus. You know, that's on um, YouTube. And I do, you know, have my website, LasoniaCultus.com. This channel is a little more free where I just be more of my, way more of myself, you know. Y'all get to see the day in the life of me. Um, 
And what I do most of the time, I am a homebody, so most of the videos may you may see me being in the home and doing stuff around the house. You may hear me every once in a while talking to my daughter. Um, my other, I have four children all together. My other three is off in college and gone. And I just have me and my baby. I call her baby, but she ain't a baby, you know. She at that preteen stage, so she ain't a baby. But our youngest is always our babies, ain't they? And watch them grow like wildflowers. And how many of our ancestors have returned in those vessels? How many? Oh, I'm so excited for my mat. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited for that mat. Just to do little things for yourself that you want is always a great thing. Okay, I got that first pile done. Let me place this up under here. What's the favorite part of y'all house? Comment that below. And what y'all think y'all ancestors' favorite part is too. What do you think y'all, they mingle at the most? Where do you sense their vibration in your home? And is it the same vibration of where y'all like to be? Y'all see me wash dishes like this. I don't like to sit it in the dish water. I want each of the dishes to have its own fresh little clean. That's just how I do mine. To each its own, but that's how I do mine. I know some might say, 
you know, um, as far as about the waste in the water and things like that. But as you can see, I have a few things that's kind of OCD-ish. <laughs> Just a few things. Let me do this to the side. Y'all, my ancestors kind of bossy, too. <laughs> they are so bossy, and they are spoiled. Oh, See, they don't mind me saying stuff, staying saying stuff like that, but once upon a time, I was an ancestor, too. This ain't my first time around, y'all. This is not my first time around.
I know they bus gonna be happy about this mat. My house seems to be their house. They we just seem to have different access points. Y'all, I'm thinking about, they got this thing, this rack. Oh, it's a rack that keep your pots and your tops and everything organized. I am on that. I'm getting it. That's going to be my next purchase. And soon as I assemble it, y'all might watch me fumble with doing it. You know, y'all might watch me fumble while I'm doing it. But I might let y'all see me kind of put it together, you know. Um, yeah. Yeah. 